What is going on guys? It's Beacon from Fan97. I'll be showing you guys how to use the voiceover in the new iMovie. Uh, it's very easy to use. So all you gotta do is you wanna go into Window in the menu bar. So go to Window and go down to Record a Voiceover or you can uh, click or press the shortcut key uh, V on your keyboard. So click Record a Voiceover. So the shortcut's really, um, really, really easy to use. Like say you're playing a video uh, or your picture or whatever and if you were to play just by pressing space, you can start recording and then just press V to start from that point or wherever part you, you pressed uh, the shortcut key. So that's really cool. But to start it from the beginning, just go like that. Um, and you wanna go, let's press V to start recording. Whoops, you press V to, um, to get the actual uh, voiceover. So right here, you will see my voice. If it's green, that means it's good. If it's really red, or it's yellow like this, then it's gonna sound pretty bad. So I try not to talk as loud. So click the green, um, or this microphone icon, and once you click it, it's gonna start recording. So you see, whoops, it gives you a countdown. As you can see, it is now recording. Um, you can't see the waveform yet, but it is working. So if you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, hit that you know like button, that will show me some love. All right, so then you click, uh, click it again to stop it. And you can see now a new waveform has been created and it's also imported into your projects menu right here. So if we were to play it back, see it is now recording. Um, you can't see the waveform yet, but so that's good. If you were to click this, um, this is the microphone. This is what you're gonna be using. Of course, I'm using a Blue Yeti and it says the input source. The input source is what you're gonna put into the, to your Mac, of course. That's what you're gonna be using. If that makes sense, right? So the output is what's coming out, and input is what's what you're putting into the computer. So that's the Blue Yeti. Now, if you're gonna do Blue uh, built-in microphone or built-in microphone, that's what I have on my built-in speakers, um, or built-in mic in my Mac, which my MacBook Pro, which is pretty cool. Uh, this also works for iMac, of course. So yeah, you select your microphone, you can adjust the volume, you can do mute project. So if you have music playing, you can mute it. Uh, so you can just listen to yourself when you're recording. Um, now, if you check this, then you won't be able to hear the project music besides the of you recording. So that's pretty, pretty cool. Now, um, of course, you can edit all of this. You can bring it down. You can turn it up to 400% and, of course, to zero. Um, that's basically all you can do, really. You can fit it in just by going like this. Um, and, yeah, that's pretty much all you can do. You can change the speed if you wanted to. And you can split them, you know, cut, paste, whatever you want to do. So that's um, basically all you're going to do to do a voiceover. And if you have more suggestions, I'm trying to read your comments. Of course, it's hard to. But I will, I'll, I, I do read your comments. Um, it's just hard replying to them, unfortunately. So, um, yeah, I won't get through all the tutorials or ideas that you guys sent me. But I do read them. And I will try to get ideas from there. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next, in my next video. So, um... It'd be, I would appreciate you guys uh, leaving a like so it helps my channel grow out. And uh, so, yeah, we're going close to 2,000 subscribers, so stay strong, and I will see you guys in my next video. Peace.